Hey everyone. First of all, I want to thank you guys for the support. I really enjoy your um your comments, your emails. I definitely enjoy when we when we go live. You guys are amazing. Let's take a look and see what's coming in for the collective at this time. What is it that we need to know? What's coming in? So five of swords keep picking this up. Petty competition. Someone trying to win at all costs. There's no win situation here that's coming in. This is possibly an air sign who maybe you defeated this person in the past. Maybe this person had to walk away. Look at this card flipping over three of pentacles. This is someone who I feel has had multiple people involved in a situation. Okay, I feel like you defeated this person. You may have possibly realized that this person had um, other people in your business or in a sit in 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 the connection. If it's not a relationship, this is someone who was just a hidden enemy, and it was revealed to you about it. But there's no win here. I feel like you come out on top, but it still doesn't feel good. You hear? So let's see what's going on with this five of sword energy. That we need to be aware of. Knight of Sword is an air sign energy. Again, this is someone who rushed in. They came in very strong, very brave, okay? Um, to speak the truth, or they will be. Why, why is the Knight of Sword out here? Two of Cups. So someone who you've already gotten a victory over wants to possibly come together with you, communicate something to you. Um, why is this though? Why now? Why now? Seven of Swords. I feel more like you're going to hear something. Someone else may come in to tell you something about this this five of sword energy here um, about some deception that they have going on once again it could be an air sign involved in this aquarius libra gemini someone could be sneaky deceptive someone could have been this way in the past or this is what's going on now feels to me like a truth is about to be revealed yep ten of swords is right it flips over this could be someone who has betrayed multiple people or betrayed you multiple times, leaving you in regret, leaving you feeling um, left out in the past. Either something's coming out about this person or this person is planning to make their way back around to you. I feel like for some of you, there's some news that's coming in. Someone is going to be presenting some type of evidence or information to you about a situation that you're either currently in or that was going on in the past that you may have um recently you know healed from you know everything now is fine but in the past you may have felt that this person really tried to do you in is this person trying to come back to have an, another go around with the collective But someone, I five of swords, seven of hierophant, will of fortune, temperance, and the star card. So someone feels that <laughs> that they have had some type of uh, spiritual awakening, some type of transformation and change that has taken place in their life or in your life. And I feel that someone wants to bring balance and healing into the connection after there has been some betrayal or deception definitely could be an Aquarius energy because I'm seeing I'm seeing air out here I also see fire though a little bit but um Queen of Cups King of Swords Shh. gotta be kidding me so yeah 
you you may have been a queen of cups to this person loving caring nurturing this person was a king of sword to you very closed off very cutthroat someone who wasn't showing emotion someone who may at some point had not made a clear decision as to what they want to do with the connection with you um this person might have been judgmental hmm Hmm. Tell me more about this then. Because I want to know what they want. Three of Wands in reverse. This is lack of movement. Something's not moving forward. So I don't know. Whoever this is, maybe, ooh, Ace of Pentacles. Just, yeah, Ace of Pentacles at the bottom. I feel like this person wants to attempt to, um, to have a new start or present something to you. But I don't see it going anywhere. Why is the Three of Wands coming out in reverse? This could have been someone who, yeah, definitely had you in a third party situation. Eight of Swords. Because you, you're you going to see that this person is still stuck, still bound, still trapped in some type of old mindset that they're, they're not, they're not healed. Whoever this Eight of, whoever this um, Air Sign energy is, this person is still in the, in a negative energy of betrayal, deceit, lies, dishonesty. And you've shown them nothing but love. Okay, and this person sees that you have grown. Things are turning around in your favor. This person sees that you've healed very well. And they watch you. Um, they watch you. Let me clarify. Because I'm looking at the star card. And for some reason, I just said they watch you. What's this? Hold on, guys. Queen of Pentacles and the um, Nine of Cups. Yeah, I feel like they watch you. They see that you've grown. They've seen that things around you are um, looking very good. Okay? And they are still seeing you as someone who they wish wish to be with. But it, it's... With the Queen of Pentacles coming out, this is dealing with stability to me. Because there's nothing about this air sign that shows stability. Why is the, why is the Nine of Cups here? Why is the Nine of Cups here? Four of one, I mean, sorry, four of swords. This air sign energy, and I'm only saying that because it's a lot of swords out here. Doesn't have to be, but this could be someone who's really in their head. For some of you, it is an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Someone here, you got, someone here sees that you are um, stable. Not only are you stable, but you're loving, you're caring, you're nurturing, you're giving. I feel like this person wants to lay this situation with you to rest or or clarify this four of swords. Three of cups. They they want to celebrate with you. Yeah. They 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 may want to heal something with you. But I feel like it's it's to reap the reward of the work that you have been doing on yourself. This person sees you in a star energy as someone whose wishes are coming true. If you're not in this energy now, this is this is what they see happening for you. Yeah. So what's gonna be the outcome when this person tries to come rushing in? Or this information comes in because for some of you, Ten of Wands, Queen of Sword, yeah, you're not dealing with it. Queen of Sword, you you see past it, you know what's up, you're paying attention to what this person says to you if they approach you, or you're paying attention to whatever um, information that comes to you regarding this person. Maybe someone else comes to you and tells you something about this person's behavior, their intentions or something like that. And I feel like um, <laughs> you are um, you are already releasing this burden, but it's going to be a burden on this person here. They're going to be burdened. 
they're going to have to deal with their own problems because ain't nobody going to um, be moving them in and taking care of them because this is what I feel for some of you. This person just wants to ride your coattail. Okay, clarify that because for some of you, this is what all it is. There's a knight of sword coming out again. There's air sign. This person here who wants to take sudden action here, but they they may be really um, just a hit. I don't know if they're hitting the enemy or this is someone who, here who was very impulsive. Okay, so I feel like their impulsive ways may have caught up to them and they're being burdened with a lot of responsibilities and they see that things around you are a lot more calmer, okay, than what they're dealing with. And I feel like this person wants to come in and lay aside. Yeah, they're going through a tower. You got the tower and the devil. Wow. They're going through failure after failure, unexpected issues and situations that are coming into their life. And I feel like they think that if they come towards you, um, things will be a lot calmer for them. Maybe they want to offer an apology because of them, what they did to you in the past. Maybe they think that's going to stop the Eight of Swords comes out again. Someone's in their own self-imposed prison or someone could be in jail. Someone also needs to be honest with themselves that they brought this on themselves. Whoever this is, they, they caused all of this. By being deceptive, being backstabbing, betraying multiple people, lying. What else did they do, guys? Leave it in the comments. Because all I'm seeing right here is someone who's trying to get out of some karma. That's all I'm seeing. Mm -hmm. Is this person going through karma? Star card comes out again. <laughs> Aquarius energy. This person is trying to remain hopeful. They try to remain hopeful that things in their life will change. They are. But I feel like they are desperate. They need help. They're in hermit mode right now. They are kind of in solitude because things around them are not going well, whoever this is. But they were in they're in the devil energy too. I feel like this person has surrounded themselves with around a bunch of lies. They live in their in their flesh. They could be dealing with addictions, lust, different bondages. And this has created tower moment after tower moment for them. But I also feel that they tried to create this for you. And now they want to heal it so that they can get out of their out of their um, funk. What's the message? Uh oh, I was going to pull the message of love, but this is the closure message. Let's see. What does this person want to say? I'm sorry I criticized you. What I say, I'm telling you, this person, they lie, they cause problems in your life, they criticize you. I am learning so much from you. I'm telling you, this person is watching you. There's just a lot of cards. They're watching you. I feel like they see how things have changed in your life and they admire you now. But the energy that they're coming towards you in, I just still don't trust it. Because it's giving me desperation. It's giving me, they need to get out of the mess that they created. I should have said what I didn't say. And I wish you love and happiness. So I'm going to leave it there, guys. Uh, for some of you, there is a there is possibly an air sign. doesn't have to be. This is someone who's just in their head a lot. That could be coming towards you. Or you're going to hear something about this person. You're going to hear something about something that they're going through. Um, something that they're planning to do. Or something here. Okay, and um, it's up to you what to do with that information. All right, so guys, I don't see anything. Uh, I don't see you doing anything because the Queen of Swords comes out as your your response. The Queen of Swords and the Ten of Wands. I feel like you see through the bull crap and you see that this person just has a lot of responsibilities and obligations and they just want some help. 
Yeah. All right, guys. So I'm going to leave this alone. I'll see you guys on the next one.